Tomorrow and Friday morning will be the best times to see the Perseid meteor shower if we can see through the wildfire haze. Of course, meteorologist Lisa Hidalgo joins us with details on what's considered the second best meteor show of the year. Yeah, second best still good. Yeah, <laughs> NASA experts say the best meteor show of the year is the Geminids, but those are in December. It's obviously a lot colder, harder to sit outside. So the Perseids are considered the most popular meteor show of the year. The good news is the Perseids could have up to 40 meteors per hour. Bad news, you got to get it pretty early. Well, super early. The best viewing is right around 3.30 a.m. to dawn. Let your eyes dark adapt for 30 to 45 minutes and don't look at your phone. It ruins your night vision, you know. So, you know, a lot of meteor people go watch meteors say, I didn't see much, you know, and I was checking my phone constantly. And I'm like, well, that's why you didn't see much, okay? So texting and watching meteor showers is not a good thing to do. I don't know who you text at 3.30 in the morning anyway. <laughs> I text my mom at around 3.30. I want to know more about those rockets. Now, the Perseids are typically a bit faint, so if you live in the metro area, you may only see one or two an hour. You do need to drive to a dark spot to see more, and obviously, yeah, the haze is a concern, and it will be with this. We're hoping, though, for some, well, a little bit better quality air quality here over the next couple of days.